Hey y'all, and welcome to the Birmingham Real Estate Market Update, COVID-19 edition. This is the 22nd week of us going through and looking at the Birmingham real estate market. And week by week, what we're doing is looking at the inventory in our market and the activity in our market and just seeing how that's unfolding through this coronavirus shutdown and now recovery. Uh, so, and we're also gonna take a look at stimulus, although there's not a whole lot happening on the stimulus front right now. So we can go ahead and get started. Uh, my name is Rob Drum. I'm a real estate broker at EXP Realty here in Birmingham, Alabama. Uh, I'll put my contact information in the link below and I'd love it if you would reach out to me if you have any real estate related questions or anything I can help with in the Birmingham area. So in the last week we had 443 closings and that compares to the previous, the same week the previous year at 583 closings. So uh, a little bit less, but again, every week we go back and look at the previous week as these numbers kind of get updated. So I think this number will get revised higher uh, last week actually got revised higher a good bit to where it was higher than the same week the previous year. So nothing too much to worry about there, but what we have on uh, the inventory picture is this entire kind of time we've been doing this all 22 weeks, we've seen a drop in active listings almost every week. And I'd like to, I really, would like to draw a picture of this kind of trajectory here that it seems to be leveling off a little bit that uh, from last week to this week, there's only a slight drop in the number of available listings. And uh, in previous, previous weeks, we've been seeing at least a hundred less available listings for people to buy. So this could be this, uh, a sign. This could be the, beginning of kind of a leveling off of inventory hopefully hopefully there's just more and more inventory coming on the market homes available for purchase i think that would help out everyone help out buyers sellers and agents and um, so hopefully that's the case we've got really the same thing on in terms of properties that are under contract we're looking at a number that's right about the same as last week. So maybe we're seeing a little bit of a shift in inventory. In terms of economic and stimulus update, uh, continuing to hear good news from small business owners that heard about the Revive Alabama grants that I mentioned that was, uh, that was giving $15,000 from st the state to small, bus small business owners. Uh, to help with coronavirus complications and economic damage that they may have experienced because of coronavirus. So uh, hearing a lot more people getting those deposits in and getting news that they've been approved. So uh, that's, that's always great to hear. And what we've got looking forward to look forward to is uh, hopefully new stimulus bill that's still being worked on in Congress. I am checking in and paying attention on seeing what may be in it and when it may be done. So I will keep you updated on that. I'd love it if you would subscribe to this channel. I'm going to continue doing this every week, keeping you updated on the Birmingham real estate market, as well as the economic and stimulus picture. Uh, for our country as a whole. So thank you for watching. Uh, again, my name is Rob Drum, and uh, y'all have a great day.